I watched the video on YouTube recently by Joshua Bardwell. It was about adding a capacitor to the PDB of your quadcopter. And there's a link to his video in the description. His point was that ESCs, such as the little bees, mess up your power system massively. They effectively make it really dirty. Now that has an effect on your video and possibly on other components as well. So this is just the back garden hover. And yes, my back garden really is that small. So you probably saw it glitched on Throttle Up. And generally the video is really bad. It's got a lot of lines across it. It's almost like looking through a dirty window. So Joshua's solution is a capacitor across the positive and negative of the PDB. So now we've got the capacitor installed, literally a five minute job, uh, minus heating the glue gun up, getting the soldering iron out, etc. Because you want to glue gun the capacitor down so it doesn't vibrate too much. And the effect is it's cleaned up the lines a lot. It's not made it perfect, but it's made it a lot more flyable and also more enjoyable to fly. It doesn't glitch anywhere near as bad on throttle up. It's different light conditions, so it's not a perfect comparison, but you should be able to tell it looks a lot better. Is it worth doing? Well, a capacitor is pennies, it's not pounds, and it's such a small component that it just makes sense to install one. I personally can't see a valid reason why you wouldn't want to. Here's a side-by-side -side comparison so you can see more clearly the difference in the quality of the video.